she's done it all. Well, maybe not all, but a lot. Once known as X-Girl, this crazy correspondent is now looking for a new high. The question is, can she find it? Mike Robinson of Starfighters. Mike, you are the guru. Tell us what you do and what is this all about? I'm so excited! April, this is all of the life support gear that's going to help you breathe and stay safe in the airplane during your flight with us here today, okay? So we'll just go okay, over... Okay, so wait a minute. I have to put all of this stuff on? Yeah, you have to put all of this stuff on. Oh my You're goodness. probably going to weigh about an extra 30 to 40 pounds when you're in the airplane with all of this gear. Oh my gosh, okay. We'll start with the most important one to most people. This is the parachute. <laughs> <laughs> You're not going to need it. Do not worry. Next is the flight helmet. Okay. This is the coolest part that we think because you get to put on the really cool Top Gun style visor <laughs> and mask and it all. And the visor does actually help you during the flight okay. um, because you don't look too silly when you pull G's. Like your face doesn't do this. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, Mike, I am ready. Not quite. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, this is this is like um, having a large child on your back. My name is Rick Spudkoff, and I'm the lead pilot for the Starfighter team. And uh, basically what we are is a three ship demonstration team, or will be next year. And uh, we'll have three of these beautiful babies out there flying in formation at the air show circuit around the US and Canada. Starfighters is the fastest privately owned jet team in the world. Um, and what keeps us alive obviously is corporate sponsorships. Uh, we're being sponsored right now by Moran Resources um, out of Houston, Texas. A little bit about the F-104. Um, the aircraft was developed back in the days when it was all about speed and how fast you can get from here to there. Um, it's still, even under current modern fighters, will still outrun, outclimb, and outaccelerate an F-16. When we start pulling Gs, your body is really working. And um, your little t-shirt here will be soaked. <laughs> it will be completely soaked. And on a normal performance that we do, we lose about four or five pounds just in water weight. Oh my gosh, that's like the perfect, most fun way to lose weight ever. Okay, so how fast have you flown in your career? Okay, I've been in this aircraft, I've been at Mach 2, which is twice the speed of sound. Oh my gosh, G-Force, here we come. And now you're all ready to go. Have fun. <laughs> um, I just have one more thing. What is that? I have to go to the bathroom. Oh, you better hold it. <laughs> Who's gonna make my lipstick? <laughs> you might leave a mark. <laughs> Starfighter 1, clear takeoff, uh, lift heading 270, climb to 1.6. Ready to go, April? Woo! I'm ready! Alright, let's do it. Yeah! Okay, April, right now we're doing about 400 miles an hour. Oh my gosh! This is amazing! How many Gs you want to pull today, April? Oh, as many as I can! Okay, Give nice. it to me! Here we go! Woo! <laughs> oh yeah! I love this! Woo! Seven hundred miles an hour, bro. Oh. You must be on that. Once you're going super time, you ought to be on by now. Woo! This is awesome! I'm still, I'm still out of breath. <sighs> and for daring above and beyond. Woo! Another class.